Hey everyone, here is a follow-up question that was on my last video about how to play the video in the end card. For those of you using iMovie, here's what you're going to do. Place an end slate of your choosing in the main timeline, and then with the video on top, you're going to split the clip and place it in front of your end slate. Make sure that your video clip is highlighted in yellow, and then select the first button at the top, and then hit the picture in picture. If your end slate is a picture file, iMovie will by default turn on the Ken Burns effect and if you don't want that on you'll need to turn it off manually. Stretch the picture to the size that you need it to fill. Now when you're previewing your project you'll see that it is large and then when it splits the video continues playing in the image. Here's a better example of what this will look like. And for everyone using Final Cut Pro here are your instructions. Okay so here we have a video file on top of an end slate can be animated or not. Go ahead and split your file, and then you're going to drag one into the main timeline, and then drag the other one so that the end card meets up with how long your video is. Then you're going to hit the video clip, hit the transform, shrink it down into the size that you want it. I used an example of a computer screen here, so just kind of futz around with it so it makes that size, and then you'll see when you go back to play it, you've got full screen video, and then when you split, you've got the video continuing in that right there. Hope that helps. Once again, here's what it looks like when it's all complete. And here's what it would look like on YouTube. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing to my channel. I put out a new video every week. I can't wait to hang out with you guys again. I'll see you very soon. Bye!